are tons of secrets with the new Dragon Ball Mythics you probably didn't know about. So today we're going to bust some myths and see what crazy things we can do with them. This is five armored walls. Can the Kamehameha break through all five? Whew. I'm nervous. Here we go. Hopefully it's a lot. One. That's it. <laughs> Only one. Well, myth confirmed, but sadly. Myth sadly confirmed. Let's try one more time. Oh, wait, that one got two. Oh, because the first one was probably weaker. Okay, so we could do like one and a half armored walls. Not bad. So here's a really weird glitch that I heard about. The myth is if somebody boxed themselves in armored walls, if you use the cloud under them, apparently you actually can get inside their box. Not sure if it works, but we built an armored wall box and now, underneath it, I'm going to use the cloud and see if it works. <gasps> that didn't work at all. I've been lied to. Let's try one more time. This time, I'm boxed in in armored walls. Let's see if I can break through one. Here we go. Ah! Woo Wait, did I just destroy the entire box? <laughs> um, so maybe this is more powerful than the Kamehameha. Maybe. That is kind of insane. Myth confirmed. But also busted but also confirmed. That is pretty overpowered. I just destroyed 10 armored walls with one cloud. What? How do these items get into the game? So the Kamehameha can only go through one and a half armored walls, but how many pieces of metal can it go through? We have 10 pieces of metal. Let's see how it does. Here we go. I'm nervous. Oh, that did a lot. Wait. So there's four left? So that went through six pieces of metal. Wow. Myth confirmed. This is one of the most powerful mythic items we've ever seen. It's now time for the ultimate duel. What happens when two players use the Kamehameha at the exact same time? It's Goku versus Vegeta. Who will win? We both have 100 health. Let's see what happens. Three, two, one, go. Oh no. Well, I destroyed him. That's because I went early. Let's try that one more time. Go! Oh, this is closer. I still win. Ha! Let's try one more time. Three, two, one, go! Uh-oh. This is gonna be close. Wait, what? Oh, they cancel each other out? That is insane. Um, okay. That is super cool. The beam just lands in the other beam and nothing happens. Crazy. No damage. Myth busted, I guess. Or confirmed. I don't even know. But that's super cool. Everybody's favorite boss is Darth Vader. But can the Kamehameha destroy Vader in one shot? That's the myth we'll be testing today. This is going to be awesome, so stay tuned. If only I could ever find a mythic Kamehameha. I've been floating forever. Your time is up, Vader. Here we go. He doesn't even know what's about to happen. Okay. That was insane. Okay, so it didn't kill him in one hit. But it did an insane amount of damage. I'm gonna pickaxe Vader. Ha! So sadly, myth busted. But it still did an insane amount of damage. This is 20 pieces of wood. A lot. And now we're gonna find out how many pieces of wood one Kamehameha breaks. One and a half armored walls. Six pieces of metal, how many wood? Let's find out. Hopefully a lot. <laughs> that was almost all of them. Hold on, how many are left? Is there literally just one piece of wood left? <laughs> There's one piece of wood left. That means it went through 19 pieces of wood. That's like an entire city. You could just destroy Tilted Towers with one Kamehameha. That is insane. Myth confirmed. So if you put the Kamehameha into a tent, you can actually get it on Spawn Island. So GKI did this, and now I'm gonna find out what happens when you use it on Spawn Island. I'm actually nervous for these people. Oh, wait. Wait, what? Okay, so it doesn't eliminate them. It just does a bunch of damage, and then you lose your HUD? Like you can't see your health or your weapons, and then you also take no fall damage. What? What a crazy glitch. Also, if you use the cloud before the battle bus, you take no fall damage the entire game. That is crazy. Myth confirmed. 
Can you use a boogie bomb to stop somebody from using the Kamehameha? Let's find out. Like, let's say you're in a fight, and this player's about to use this mythic weapon on you. How can you stop them? Other than shooting them, obviously. But let's say you don't have a weapon, but you have a boogie bomb. Here we go. Ah! Well, I was too slow. <laughs> Alright, so I was definitely too late on that. Let me try that one more time. I definitely saw Vegeta dancing, so it, it might have worked. Just kidding, we're out of mythics. So, uh, okay. Let's just say myth confirmed. Why not? Enjoy dancing, Sky. Or tree. Can the mythic lightsaber block the Kamehameha? The two mythic weapons clashing. Which one is better? The Kamehameha or the lightsaber? Well, if it isn't... Oh, who's that? What? 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 I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die in my private game! I thought that was Vegeta! Who hired an NPC? I'm gonna die! Who is Panther? What just happened? Well, there's no way I'm getting the lightsaber again. So I'm just gonna react. So here's GKI, and let's see what happens to him. <laughs> he got destroyed. The lightsaber has no chance against the Kamehameha. That is insane. Myth busted. And it's official that the Kamehameha is one of the best mythic items we have ever seen. How far does the Kamehameha actually go? This is the ultimate test. I'm going to test it at different distances. This is about 100 meters away from that piece of wood. Let's see if it reaches it. It... Okay, it does. Let's go even further. Let's try 150 because this is actually really far away. This is like farther away than like a sniper rifle. Uh, Vader, you're definitely gonna want to move. This is about to get blue. Okay. That also killed it. All right. Well, my path is about to end. How far does this actually last? 235 meters. Let's go to 250. 250 meters is a lot of meters. It's like a good chunk of the Fortnite map. Let's see if it hits it. Probably not. We have found the answer. Well, kind of. It cannot do 250 meters. All right, 200 meters. Let's see. Nope. Vader said it was super close. So let's try like 195. Here we go. Yes, it broke it. So I think we found the ultimate distance. 195 meters, which is a lot. You can basically snipe somebody from here to here. It's crazy. Myth confirmed. Ow. Everybody knows the giant cuddle team leader roller coaster, right? It's right there. I've heard a rumor that the Kamehameha can actually break the coaster. And normally that's indestructible. Let's see if it's true. It is time for the ultimate test. Goodbye, stupid teddy bear. Oh, I've been lied to. It does nothing. <laughs> well, that's kind of sad. Myth busted, I guess. Can you grapple onto an enemy who's using the Kamehameha? That's what we're about to find out. So Vegeta's going to jump in the air, and I'm going to try to grapple onto them. I'm kind of scared, but I'm excited. I hope this works. No! I can't! That's sad. I got the tree instead. Let's try one more, except this time not in front of a bunch of stuff, so I don't accidentally grapple onto random things. I'm going to wait for it to start blasting. Well, that's sad. I just do this. I just punch sadly. Take this, stupid Vegeta. Can you grapple onto a junk rift? Wait, where is it? Oh, wait, let me try that again. Huh. I hate the grapple glove. Myth busted. That'll do it for this video, everybody. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I love doing myth videos, so if you have ideas for myths that you want to see me test, let me know down in the comments, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!